after the wave hit, the lights in the engine shut off and the car no longer moves. So I carry the children one at a time uh, on my back across the street to the playground where they can sit under awning and stay dry while I push the car out the middle of the road. My name is Tuary Brown. I'm 36 years old. And I'm a teacher in Chesapeake, Virginia. I'm married with three children. The first time I experienced flooding was last summer. I was here in Norfolk. I've heard of it. I've seen it on the news, but it was not. I was not prepared for the experience of getting stranded. Normally, when it rains. This, uh, so severely, the parents, especially ones who do not have transportation, will begin to walk early to come pick up their children to avoid the flood. Being inside, I did not see how bad it was outside. So when they started to come, <laughs> I started to get worried. I was like, you know, they were saying, it's really bad. You got to get out of here. You know, some people who even walked to pick their kids up could not walk back. I, told, I said, let's go. You know, I, I correspond with the mom, and I, 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 we, we had an idea to meet just two streets away, and I can see her truck, and she can see me. <laughs> but we never made it <laughs> to each other. Uh, another city truck actually came down the road towards me, mm -hmm. and the speed and momentum and the amount of water was so intense that a wave washed over the hood of my car, and it just conked out. It was, it was it was scary and we were very lucky. I was uh, lucky that the car eventually started. That was a blessing because I know many people's car did not survive that storm. Um, all the things I had was damaged that day. All the things I had in the car was done. The trunk and the, the books that the kids carried and never made it. But at the time, I, I could remember clearly at the time, it was very, very frustrating, but uh, I had to stay calm.